Now let us understand what is a decade, what is century and what is millennium. So these are all measurements of time. Let's start with year, right? You know one year. Now one year has how many months? Let's start with that and then we'll figure out decade, century and millennium, right? One year has how many months? So we'll write one year equals to how many months? Well, you know it, it is 12 months. How about days? One year has how many days? 365 days. Now, how about weeks? Do you know that part? Well, I find that many students do not know how many weeks are there in one year. Let's write it down. One year has 12 months, 365 days. In a leap year, however, there are 366 days, right? But in general, we write 365. So let me write 366 also, and that is for leap year, okay? As far as weeks are concerned, there are 52 weeks in a year. And you know, there are seven days in a week. Okay, now let's come to our main question. And that is, how about decade, century, and millennium. Now what is one decade? Now whenever we say one decade, it means always 10 years. It means 10 years as far as years are concerned. Okay, so one decade is 10 years. How about one century? Century is 400. When we say one century, then with reference to years, it will mean 100 years. Okay, 100 years. Now, it's for you to answer, if it is 100 years, how many decades? Okay, so think about it and write it down. Now, let's get to the millennium. Okay. One millennium is how many centuries? So let me write down here. One millennium. It is equal to how many centuries? Do you know it? One millennium is 10 centuries. Okay. So one millennium is 10 centuries, right? If it is 10 centuries, then how many decades? Think about it and then write down your answer. And how many years? Well, we know one century is how many decades? One century is 10 decades. Let me write in a different ink. One century is 10 decades. So if I say that one millennium is 10 centuries, number of decades will be 10 times. So it will be 100 decades. Do you get it? Yes. And we also learn that one decade is 10 years. So 100 decades is how many years? One more 10. So it is thousand years, right? So I think all these conversion factors gives you a good idea about measurement of time in years, decades, centuries and millennium. Now as an exercise, what you can do is you can find how these things are related. So what I will do this time is I'll write down, let us say if we have 20 centuries, right? So then that is equal to how many years and how many decades? Think about it and write down your answer. Thank you and all the best.